out of all the sleep hygiene things that you can do, light control is the biggest thing, right? To anchor your biology to light during the day, first part of the day, and to anchor your biology to darkness at night, that's the most powerful stimulation for the brain to say, hey, it's time to go to bed, it's time to wake up. So primarily, that's how jet lag works. Right. The reason you jet lag and you adjust to the jet lag, because when you travel, say, to Japan and they're like completely opposite time zone, like our day is their night. But after a few days there, what happens is just by virtue of being exposed to the light for a few days during their hour, daytime hour, then your biology shift to that time zone. The adaptation to a different time zone is really majority from light, but then secondarily to a smaller degree from meal timing. Because when you're sleeping, you're not eating. So that meal timing also tells your brain that, oh, it's morning because I'm eating this first meal. It's nighttime. I'm eating my last meal and it's dark and it's light. That really sinks that rhythm.